Hey y'all, it's Matt from McCoy's Vapor Shop. I got a little uh, uh, public service announcement for y'all. Um, it's about vaping in public. Um, I don't even know how I want to say this really. I guess, you know, there's no secondhand smoke or secondhand vape with these things. They are safe in a secondhand type way. Um, but even so, we need to. Uh, we need to be courteous of non-vapors. A lot of people are scared of these things. They see these big clouds of vapor coming off and they don't know if it's safe. And, uh, you know, and a lot of times it gets confused um, as cigarette smoke, which scares a lot of people. I know in New York they just banned uh, e-cigs in public places. Now, it looks like that might get overturned because... Um, Basically, the only reason they ban them is because it looks like cigarette smoke, the public image. Um, and I'm not saying let's not vape in public because that's just ridiculous. Yeah, it's just ridiculous. Um, but I am saying let's be courteous uh, of non-vapers. When we do vape, blow the vape either straight up or straight down. Don't blow it in someone's face. Um, when you're sitting at a restaurant, um, don't just blow big clouds of vapor because you know, it scares people. They don't know what it is. They think you're smoking right there at the table. You know, blow it down towards your table. Um, don't blow it up in the lights so where I know it looks cool and you want to show off or whatever, but um, let's not do that. That um, you know, all it takes is one person to get mad, one person to uh, get offended. Um, as much as that may suck, that's the society we live in today. One person gets offended and, you know, the government has to do something about it. And that's really what it takes. It takes one person to get offended, taking it to city council and say, I don't like these vapors, you know. Um, so let's... Let's try to be courteous of people that don't vape. You know, and when you are courteous, when you do blow it down and don't blow it in people's face, um, you actually will get more questions about it, you know, and everybody wants to spread the word about their vape. Um, but when you're blowing it in people's face, people are like, they don't even want to talk to you. They don't want to, they want to sit over there and give you dirty looks and whisper about you. But if you're being respectful, people will come up and ask you about it. Say, hey, that's not a cigarette. What is that? And they'll ask you questions. And being that you're being respectful, um, they'll want to hear what you have to say. And that's really what we want. That's the public image we want. So I'm not saying let's not vape in public. I'm not saying let's not vape indoors in public. I'm saying when you do, be respectful about it. Um, we don't want these to get banned, and the science says they shouldn't be banned. So let's just be respectful. Let's, I don't know, let's not put a bad taste in people's mouth that doesn't know anything about vaping. Um, anyway, that's my rant for today. Thanks.